I need some oil. Yeah. Look, I've, I've walked through these alleyways. I don't know where this thing is. I'm looking for a glyph. Find that symbol, Sarah. Okay. It should react to the light if you use your lamp. This is giving me, like... He's getting stronger and more aggressive. If he catches up with you, try blinding him. Great. I don't know where he is, though. I'll never forgive myself for this painting. Just so we're still clear, I still never forgive myself for this painting. This is giving me, like, really... Oh, it glows. The glyph. I can't move it. Is it acting against me? The ritual is working. Don't worry. It's just until I ward it off. Okay, we'll ward it off. Oh, no. The Wanderer is back. Okay, ward it off, then. <laughs> Oh, I can't drop. Back, demon. I'm safe now. Yeah. The second symbol has been revealed. You know what you have to do, Sarah. Okay. Right, where is, uh... I know what I'm looking for now. Where is the, uh, symbol? Uh -huh. Let's press on. This is like very old school like PlayStation 1 games where the the characters like are giving you the hints, but the hint is just the same thing over and over again and it's, it doesn't actually help you. Aha. Uh -huh. The symbol must be here somewhere. Look closely. Glyph must have appeared. Let's press on. All right. Give He's me that. Stronger and more aggressive. If he catches up with you, try blinding him. Yep. Yep. All right. Back. Hell yeah. Now is when matters get complicated. I must breach the barrier to ward off the creature. What the fuck are you talking about? You have about? to lure it in front of me, Sarah. Do you understand? Once it goes after you, I need you to guide it towards me. Uh, right. Let me guess, this third one's going to be in a really dumb combo. All oh, right, there. All right, let it come to the Drake boy. Release me now! Algernon! Done! painting and it starts all up again. <laughs> I can hear him. He calls me. Sarah! No! Algernon. My old friend. Oh, uh, what are you doing? It's too late. I'm gluey. Must resist! Please! Don't! No. 
Don't do it. Don't. I would be fucking grabbing this lady by her hair. And I'm telling you, these people are dumb, like, fuck. Chapter 11, back to the police station. Sarah Hawkins, together with Drake Boy, managed to permanently drive the Dimensional Shambler back at the end of a fierce battle of running away. However, the feat of strength cost her what left of her self-awareness. She has succumbed to the call of the myth. Bum, 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 bum. Sarah Hawkins. Why did she do it? <sighs> Damn it. Did our guest enjoy our hospitality? Let me out of here. I'm warning you, Pierce. I want a short and clear cut confession. Do you admit your guilt in the case brought before you? You don't have any idea what's happening on this damn island. Chief West, we got a problem. Damn it, not now. What is it this time? Captain Fitzroy, Chief. Some guys have ransacked Roy's bar. They went berserk, attacked the patrons, smashed the place up. It's chaos. This is only the beginning. Let me out. <sighs> Let's go take a look. Tell Sullivan and Marshall to keep this one nice and warm till I get back. Are you stupid? Don't you understand? Those goddamn idiots. Press F to sleep. I find you again. Ah, yeah, I'm still in the same place. Promised, it's not a big fucking thing, dude. To relax. Reiterate the offer of truth. As your mind expands and finally understands the true nature of the world, your perceptions change. Are you ready to see your world and the ones that live in it as they truly are? Yeah, right. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Come for truth seeker. Follow the path of the ultimate truth. I'm ready for my truth. Oh, it's water. Yeah. Some stuff detected. Fighters. Survivors. I never would have thought you so naive. It's all your fault. You could have stopped this whole thing. Your army buddies. The villagers. Me. We're all in danger. As long as you're alive. Right, right. Ah. Shot through the heart, and you're too late. That lady killed my friend. I can't go to sleep. I keep having the same dream. Or should I say, nightmare? Pain in my chest as if I was being skewered. Darkness, cold, silence. Then I wake up in a hospital bed alive. Your voice whispers in my mind. I keep hearing it, and I, I don't know how long I'll be able to resist. Me. I may see you in my dreams. 
I still can't decide if you will be my doom or my liberation. This fate it may have been given for both of us, but I will fight for what is right. It's me, professional truth seeker. Uh -huh. Dom, what happened? Come, you'll want to hear what these two Egypts have to say. This better be interesting. I'm Seems like now. someone decided to grant you your deepest wish. A mutiny? <laughs> Worse, they killed Chief West. What? And left his body in one of our warehouses. You're kidding. They're all yours. Which one of you is dumb enough to kill a cop and throw him on my doorstep? <laughs> we don't know nothing. The dead body in my warehouse disagrees. We swear, miss, it's not us. I don't have time for this. Spill it. We've got nothing to do with it. <clears throat> Alright, I'm cat. Uh, I'm in a bad mood. I want mood. to know everything about the corpse over there. Or I swear you will meet the same end. If we speak to you, we're dead. If we don't speak to you, we're dead. What? No! Listen, miss. We didn't see what happened, but we heard. Uh, noises and talkings, like... We've been betrayed. By whom? Go. Look at the body. You'll find out for yourself. Interesting. Let's go, Dom. Where is this workshop? I'll go with you. He must be talking about the old boat repair workshop. They've done nothing wrong. Apart from killing a cop on our turf. That's hooey. How do you know they killed him? Do you want me to settle it with some lead? Scurvy dog always threatening us. Shoot one, make an example. I mean, uh... What if they didn't do it, though? Quieten these lunkheads down before I shiv the lot of them. Ooh. I'll take care of them. A bunch of liquor sponges aren't going to lay down the law around here. I'll take a look at this workshop. Join me when you're finished. Yo, he looks like someone from out of Cluedo. Look, he's got like, uh, he's like green. What was the green guy's name? Professor... Doctor... Who's the green one? Here we are. Here we are. Where's this body? Fuck, where is the body? Oh, why am I so bad at- oh. Oh. Blech. Is it literally just Mr. Green? That's such a dumb name. Everyone else is like, Professor Plum, or Miss Scarlet, or Colonel Mustard. Nope, Mr. Green. If someone had told me that one day West's work would kill him. Oh, I can do reconstruction mode. <laughs> hmm. Someone moved the corpse here. Where did the murder happen? <laughs> we came from here. Uh huh. It's pretty obvious since that's the only way to go into that building. Well done, cat. You should be a uh, professional detective. Well done. Down the stairs. What do you mean down the stairs? Oh, right. Well, we saw the blood. What are you fucking talking about? We know he there's only one door, cat. <laughs> cat. I can't even interact with this one. Oh, there we go. So this is where West was killed. What's that? What the fuck is that? Where did it come from? Uh, it's a cultist. He wasn't alone. Who were those guys?
Or am I, uh... Why is it glitchy? And, uh, what am I, what am I looking at? Aha. There's only one man who smokes these gaspers. <gasps> Fitzroy. Fitzroy. You're not supposed to be here, truth seeker. What's going on outside? Oh. Oh, I got a gun. <gasps> what the fuck? All right, I'm just fucking murdering. Oh, I'm a I'm a dead person, huh? 